Honey Cake, a Family of Spices, written by Medea Kalantar. This book is dedicated to my children, Shanaz and Jean Diar, who blessed me with my beautiful honey cakes, who inspired me to write our story. I would also like to dedicate this book to my grandmother, Bebby, who taught me how to bake my first honey cake. Thank you, Bebby, for being our guardian angel and for watching over us as we welcome our new generation. Dear parents, grandparents, and guardians, this book is an introduction to a diverse, multicultural family that is full of love. There will be a series of books to follow with valuable life lessons to help you teach your children the tools they need to overcome any obstacle. In this book, the grandmother explains why she calls her grandchildren honey cakes while she teaches her granddaughter how to bake a honey cake. Through imagination, the grandmother explains that each delicious ingredient in the honey cake represents a different family member and his or her unique multicultural background. I hope you enjoy this book. I've included the recipe at the back so you can bake your own delicious batch of honey cake with your honey cakes. Blessings of love and light, Medea. Here is a wonderful illustration of my entire family of spices. As you know, these books are all based on my actual family. Hi, my name is Nala. I'm six years old. Oh, my mom is calling me. Nala, we have to get going now. Please come downstairs and put your shoes and coat on. We're going to visit my grandparents, who are my mama's mom and dad. See you later. Coming, mama. When they arrive at her grandparents' house, Nala's mother lets her ring the doorbell. Ding dong. A plump older lady answers the door. Nala, my little honey cake, come give your grandma some sugar. Hi, grandma. I'm so excited to spend the day with you. What should we do today? asked Nala. Well, what would you like to do, my little honey cake? asked Nala's grandma. Let's bake a cake, says Nala. Good idea, said Nala's grandma. The two of them head into the kitchen. Grandma, why do you call me your honey cake? asked Nala. Well, like this cake we're going to bake today, Nala, you are made up of many different spices, says Nala's grandma. I'm not made of spices, says Nala. <laughs> no, 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 Nala's grandma laughs. What I mean is that your background is made up of many different cultures, just like this honey cake is made of many different ingredients from around the world. Let's start making the cake and I will explain. Nala's grandma starts lining up all the ingredients they will need to bake the honey cake. Okay, Nala, we are ready to begin now. Nala, I was born in a country called Georgia, south of Russia, and your grandpa was born in Persia. We come from two different countries and cultures. So imagine I'm the vanilla ingredient and your grandpa is the cinnamon. When your grandpa and I got married, we made your mama and Uncle JD. I call them my love muffins because they come from two very special ingredients. Nala, can you please pass me the salt, brown sugar, baking powder, baking soda, cocoa, cloves, and coffee? Sure, Grandma, here you go, says Nala. Thank you, Nala, you're so helpful, her grandma says. Okay, Nala, now imagine all these ingredients made your dad. Your daddy's made up of a big mix of different cultures. Holy cow, Grandma! Why does Daddy have so many different ingredients? asked Nala. Nala's grandma giggles at Nala's expression as she stands there with her eyes and mouth wide open. 
That's because your daddy's father is Jamaican and his mother is Guyanese, which is part Chinese, East Indian, African, white, and Portuguese, explains Nala's grandma. Nala, could you please pass me the final ingredient, which is the honey, asked Nala's grandma. Here you go, grandma, Nala replies. Why, thank you, my little honey cake. You're such a good helper, says Nala's grandma. Who is the honey, Grandma? asked Nala. Well, the honey is your mama. She is a mix of your grandpa and me, answered Nala's grandma. Nala and her grandma add all the ingredients to the bowl, and they mix the batter all together. Nala helps her grandma pour the mixture into a pan, and they place it in the oven to bake. Oh, Grandma, the cake smells so good, said Nala. Nala, do you understand why I call you my honey cake now? asked her grandmother. I think so, Grandma, Nala says. Nala, her parents, and grandparents all sit at the dining room table with the warm dessert in the center. They all enjoy a piece of honey cake with a glass of tea and milk for Nala. This honey cake is delicious, says Nala's grandpa. That's because of all the different ingredients that each of us bring to the recipe, says Nala. What do you mean, Nala? asked her father. We are a family of spices, Nala says proudly. Nala's grandma picks Nala up in her arms and gives her a soft kiss on the forehead. That's right, my honey cake. We are a family of spices. Remember, Nala, even though we are all look different and come from different places, we are all part of one race, the human race. In this beautiful world we live in, we are all one says Nala's grandma. Back at home, Nala looks in the bedroom mirror and thinks about all the unique ingredients that make her one of a kind. What kind of honey cake are you? Ask your parents or grandparents and bake your own honey cake that's special, just like you.